We are all monsters in the dark, my boy. How many times have you talked about this? Each book from my father's library was nothing. Dr. Sechenov just held a press conference in which he completely denied rumors about civilian robots malfunctioning at Facility 3826. The facility is back to full operational capacity, <sighs> and the red alert Finally will be back with very us, soon. Sonny. You took Collective a real pounding, didn't you? Will be you were pretty close to staying planned. there for good. Where? You tell me. How am I supposed to know where you are when you're on the bloody rampage? You were a nice boy when my daughter was around, but... Ever since she passed away, you do nothing but sulk and fly off the handle at the drop of a hat. Nothing but blood and ripped off heads everywhere. <sighs> Disgraceful. What's your daughter got to do with me? <sighs> My Katinka. Our Katinka. <laughs> they played hell with your memory, Sonny. Lady, what are you talking about? She was my daughter, but she was your... Ekaterina Nechaeva, codenamed Blesna. Member of the Argentum Spec Ops Squad. So you must be... Your mother-in-law, you stupid ignoramus. You worked for Sechenov until those Bulgarian terrorists blew you up. Katya didn't make it. Then Sechenov turned you into a monster. Yeah, I may have heard something about that. Why are you just sitting there if you already knew? I've been keeping an eye on you ever since. I figured there must be some humanity somewhere in you. Sorry, lady, but you figured wrong. My past, my present, it's all gone. W wait, where's Larissa? She's everywhere. You scattered her to the four winds. <sighs> Fuck. You got a gun, lady. Does it look like I don't have one? What would you like? Anything will do. I just need to blow my head off. Great idea. Just blow your own damn brains out and be that done stand with down, it. lady! Then set an off cut on oh. everyone into mindless meat bags. First the hey. Soviet Union, then the rest Bye of the world. I get it! If you get it, then get up! I'll give you weapons, lots of them. But only if you promise me you'll put that freak down once and for all. What's the matter? Cat got your tongue? Listen to your elders, Major. 
Comrade Sechenov's deeds demand vengeance. What? What is this shit, Sergei? It is me, Zinaida. Charitan Zaharov. Charitan? You devil! You're alive! In a sense. An evil wizard turned me into polymer goo. Wait a fucking minute. Are you telling me you've known Granny Zena this whole time? Keeping secrets can be very useful, Major. They haven't let us down yet. Useful to who? You keeping secrets is letting me Such down. Sechenov must be off his rocker if he's doing this kind of stuff to people. Wait a second. What about Katya? Kartinka? Could she still be alive? It's possible, but in what state? Just look at me. I'm not sure I'm better off, but I don't have hard data at this time. I'm begging you, Sergei. Sechenov has to die! Jeez, get off my back already! Crispy critters! What the hell is going on around here? On the one hand, I've got lying, manipulative dicks who claim to be noble Avengers. On the other, I've got a Soviet scientist and member of the Academy who wants to enlighten all mankind and use me to get rid of assholes. According to the manipulative dicks, that is. You may be in danger. What do you mean? The break room isn't safe anymore. No, handsome. My room will always be safe for you. I won't let anyone in, as long as you're here. Then where is this threat coming from? Your glove! It is manipulating you. Take it off before it's too late, and we'll be together till death do us part. Oh, uh, man. I'm sick of you going on about the glove. But I'm right, darling. Yeah, yeah, you just want to murder me. Not gonna happen. How could you even think that, sugar? I only kill pathetic, horny little pipsqueaks who try to enter me when all I want is you. How many times do I have to tell you to stop killing people? But that's beyond me, sugar. I can't help myself. Then you'll have to deal with the glove until you can. You should forbid her from telling you to remove the glove. You see? Then come on, Sergei. Vengeance awaits. Don't rush me. One thing at a time. I would prefer that we reach such it out before Collective is updated and it is too late to change anything, in case you don't like his answers. that left or right? Uh, same difference. You have no idea how right you are. What are you looking at, Major? Fight! has no desire to dance with you. Don't give up, Major. We need to get upstairs. Which one is using everything she has to kill you? Use everything you have.
Heart Project, approved by the Secret Congress of the CPSU Central Committee on February 14, 1951. The goal is the suppression of the United States of America, change of political regime, abolition of capitalism, establishment of communism, establishing social and moral ideals consistent with the beliefs of a Soviet person. The method of execution is the seizure of the strategic and military facilities followed by disconnection and shutdown of nuclear power plants. Effective deactivation of the atomic heart of America, complete surrender of the government, and the transfer of power to the top leadership of the USSR. So how are they gonna pull that off? Well, Sergei, first they sell robots, then they simply give them away as aid. Once they reach critical mass, they take over all the power plants and cut off the power. Greetings, honored members of the Politburo. I am pleased to inform you that the Atomic Heart Project is now complete and ready for launch. This is a top secret project designed to... Authorization. Major Nichayev, codename P3, access granted. Boss? Protect. Well, Cheriton, are you proud of yourself? You, Larissa, and Zenaida have certainly been busy. But, Sergei, I wouldn't have expected you to be quite so gullible, my boy. Silence! You messed with my head. You wiped my memory. Am I a toy to you like those other people connected to Collective? 
Who the fuck Calm do you down, think you Sergei. are? Sergey, I can see you're terribly upset. It's okay, I don't blame you. But you, Cheran, you were supposed to help the boy not pull his strings like a puppet. Me? Don't you blame this on me? I'm not the one trying to deprive everyone of their free will, turning them into mindless puppets. But it wasn't my choice to be a talking pile of goo, either. You're glad it happened, aren't you? You'll use everything and everyone to achieve your goal, including me and your agent. Admit it! How dare you! I lost you both, then saved your lives. You're both scientific miracles. You were... You are my best friend, Sheraton. And the Major is like a son to me. And those two are like daughters, right? And everyone you're going to connect to collective... Everyone whose minds you're going to control. Who are they to you? Millions of foster kids? Everyone is just grist for your mill, Dimitri. I want to give mankind a spectacular future. Unimaginable achievements. I want to give them a path to the star. Both of you, shut up! Get your hands up! Some goddamn wizard you are. Tell him to stand down. I'm counting to three. One! What a shame. Two! It's a shame you've escalated this situation without even trying to resolve it peacefully. But I won't let you stand in the way of progress. Right, left, terminate. What living fuck is this? Stop messing with my head! So one of these robots is Ekaterina Nechaiba, the wife I don't remember? Well, which one? They both are! I tried to bring Lesna back to life when her brain was literally ripped in half. I wanted to restore her right and left hemispheres, but the process was too complicated. What the shit? But why? You're already fucking with people who are still alive. That's enough, boss. I'm willing to believe that you were acting in my best interests. But why couldn't you just tell me? I'm sorry, Sir. You are so long. Major! Wait! Right now. Katya. Your wife is dead. Sechenov took her from you. Surrender, P3, and give me Cheriton before anyone else gets hurt. Dimitri is suggesting that I'll be hurt. You will be next, Major. Find me. Do you really kill your own wife, Sergei?
You lousy you piece don't of shit. Sheraton's manipulating you. He gained access to the Voskhod module in your brain and started sending you to limbo. I was busy getting ready for the collective update, so I didn't realize it right away. He's the one who killed Molotov. Tell me, Cheriton, did you do the same thing to Dr. Falatova? <laughs> did you use my agent to tear her limb from limb? I'm sick of your hypocrisy, Dimitri. I did your dirty work while you stayed squeaky clean. But they didn't deserve to die. Why have you done this? <clears throat> You motherfucker, this whole time. I've had quite uh, enough of you, Major. Uh, Your uh, job is done. Uh, uh. P3, my boy. Get up. Get up. What do you want? I want all this to end, Dimitri. I want your pathetic human race to realize it has no future. It's time for it to step aside and make way for the next phase of its evolution. Due to humanity and collective. You should not call something evil just because you cannot comprehend it. Evil is an abstract concept, and your thinking is limited. You are a human, a species that will soon be extinct. I realized when I stopped being human myself. Your limitations prevent you from seeing the truth. Dumb humans don't want to evolve. All they want is comfort and satisfaction on someone else's dime. You never wanted to join with the massive array. No. Don't, Charity. No. I The Argentum unit entered Dr. Sechenov's office and found no trace of the doctor. According to partially reconstructed footage, it appears the humanoid neuropolymer object approached Dr. Sechenov's body and then completely consumed it. After the events described in the report, the unidentified humanoid neuropolymer object left Dr. Sechenov's office and vanished.
nothing I can do If you, if you leave me here too